So today we decided to take the dogs on a little field trip. My wife Carlin and I have a opportunity to buy a commercial lot for 90,000. It's worth 150. Today we wanted to go walk the property to make sure that it's all high and dry, that it looks very buildable. It's on Fort Morgan Road, which is like a peninsula that goes out from Gulf Shores and Mobile Bay is on the north side and the Gulf of Mexico is on the south side. So it's about 27 miles long and when you get to the end, you're kind of in the middle of nowhere. There's not a whole lot of stores. There's a lot of houses for people that like to be way out there, kind of away from the human civilization. This lot is kind of maybe halfway down. It's kind of in the woods. It's a big sand dune. It, we just thought it'd be fun to take the dogs down there, walk the lot, make sure we felt like it was a very buildable lot. It's going to be a long-term play if we do decide to move forward with the purchase. Even though we're getting it undervalued, it, it's more of a prime location for the future. So it's kind of like investing in Facebook 10 years ago, you know, before Facebook was huge. And that's kind of what we're thinking on this lot. And oh, I almost ran out of gas and we got the dogs some puppy chinos from Starbucks. Y'all enjoy. That's Fort Morgan Road over there. There's a little buffer in between Fort Morgan Road and actually the beginning of the lot. I'll show you where the lot actually begins. Right here where these signs are. So right here is where the front of the lot is. There's a commercial building right on the other side of those trees. It's a uh, real estate company. And the lot runs 100 feet right here. And then 250 feet deep. So what I'm looking for is the elevation. I just want to make sure that it's all high and dry. We're coming. Got your 10X hat on. Oh yeah. Ooh, little cactus plants. So we are on the beach, so this whole lot is sand. It's a big sand dune. Here's the back side of the uh, adjoining real estate office. Not sure exactly where the back side of this lot is.
but it's 250 feet. So it goes way back here. But based on where that real estate office is, you wouldn't have to build all the way back here, but all this does look really high and dry with these pine trees. Not sure how far back it goes there. If we buy this lot, it's going to be looked at as a long-term play. We'll probably put it right back on the market, but don't really care if it sells or not. And if we still own it in the next five or ten years, maybe we'll build some commercial spots. You know, maybe a little strip center or, you know, just something commercial to rent. What do, the, what do Bam Bam and Minnie think about it? I love it? the sand. It's like a big sand dune right here. And then it goes down over there. What do you think? I love it. You like it? Like it for a long term play, you know. <laughs> so, a couple things that we're wondering is, is can you put a sign up for the development out on the right. easement of Fort Morgan Road, which they didn't do it next door, so I don't think you can. Also, is this property in the county or the city? And what are they, what's the requirements? And then can you cut the trees down that are on the easement of Fort Morgan so more visibility for the uh, commercial complex you would build? It seems to me you could put a three unit strip center right there. We could just build it, uh, metal buildings for sure. But I uh, just got to do a little more research. Bam Bam love the sand though. Oh yeah. think we could put there? Ice cream shop and gift sundry stop shops. Oh, where what? people are checking in. Mm -hmm. Ice cream shop. Yeah. Gift slash you know souvenirs? Like, no. Sundries. Sundries? <laughs> Start over. I don't know what that let is. me make sure I'm saying it right. <laughs> Sundries. What is sundries? Um, toiletries, you know, because they're checking in right next door. So that's where they can that's go. That's not a, that's a, that's a real estate. I thought that they, that was rentals. Oh, well still, they're coming all the way down Fort Morgan Road. There's not anywhere to get anything yeah. like that. Yeah. So sundries and an ice cream shop. Yeah. I think I think what what we would do though is just build three units and then let whoever rent them rent them. Yeah, I'm just saying them. what yeah. I think would do well there. Yeah. What do you think? I think it's going to be t 
tough because you don't really have much visibility. If you can't put a sign out right on the road saying, hey, you know, and, you know, nobody's going to know you're there. If you can't cut the trees and you can't put a sign out there on the easement, I think it's going to be a tough, tough sell. Well, we have to see if we can cut the trees. Yeah. Might be able to. Well, maybe. Looks like they cut some trees, but only right in front of their lot, too. You know, that's another thing. If you can cut some trees right in front of your lot, that's not really going to help visibility for people driving down the road. There's trees right next to it. Gotta be able to put a sign.